All right, I think I'm unmuted. We have game audio as well. So I guess we can resume. I hope you all had a short little break. Took care to not, you know, dry out and stuff. Oh. What's this music? That sounds weird. Okay, so I guess we can get into this building, but it has blood flies. Where is the person we heard yawn just now? I don't like when there are yawning people that I can't hear. You can hear me in the game at least. Okay, that's good then. Uh, I guess down there is someone. Let's see. <coughs> Private rooms. Oh. Isn't that where we came out? Yeah. Oh my. Is that my breath I'm smelling? Maybe my teeth are due for their monthly cleaning. Interesting. Can we get up there? Huh. Okay, I see a blood fly nest. That's not good. What are those screams? Jeez. Oh, hello. Hello, miss. It's kind of weird. Oh, okay, those are the two guards. And those are lots of blood flies. <coughs> All right. So I guess we have uh, combustion bolts. Quite a number of nests. <gasps> Whoops. Something's oh. I can feel it. Uh oh. Okay, that's interesting. There's a person among the blood flies. Jesus. Okay. That's not good. Hello? Anybody? Don't make me search the whole place. I don't have time for that. Let me answer all me answer all of this crap at once. Disloyalty, disloyalty, will not be tolerated. Will not be tolerated. Look 
Karnaka needed miners, needed and miners, he produced and them. he produced them. Out of thin air! Out of thin air! That's the Sarkonic That's spirit. The Sarkonic spirit. That's what we need. That's what we need. Fake wine. We found a corrupt pawn charm. That's where some yikes, yeah. Um, oh, and uh, you earlier said, uh, Andy, uh, hush, little baby, don't you bark. Mama's gonna get you an outsider's mark. <laughs> That's a good one. Grandfather clock. Why can you set an alarm on a grandfather's clock? That seems kind of weird. Can I? There's fire here. Why can I use this to set the thing on fire? The southern winds presented at the academy for the benefit and moral edification of the pupils therein. Cherished students and learned colleagues, have you not heard the tales of Sirkonos and the beauty of its people? I pose questions today that I hope to answer in great detail. Let's start with the ones commonly asked by travelers for many decades. Oh, I think we've had that. We've read that before. I guess pilfered safe combination. I'm certain I saw one of the students at my lecture writing down the combination for my safe. That silver spoon dilettante who wants to make a ca career as a newspaper journalist. Sneaky fuck. He's chosen a fitting career and his snobby cousin operates the black market shop nearby. So it must run in their well-heeled family. Now I need to ask Margaret to change the combination of my safe. Ashworth within an existential graph. Okay. Whoops. So... Bloodfly Keeper doesn't sound like something that would be fun. I wonder if that's like, uh, if it's just a bloodfly infested building, like all the others, and he is a weird, or if that will count as, uh, you know, chaos and a kill. Can I, why can't I pick this up and throw it? Crown Killer is watching. It's interesting how everyone does their graffiti in white paint. I guess what I'll just do is this. Alright. I think that mostly worked. Since I don't have many more fire arrows. Okay, so the conservatory is here. But we wanted to visit the associate. Just because in the first scene they wanted us to spin the globe. We can do it everywhere. Still wonder if that's Luca Abel? Or if that's... The other... The old duke. Doesn't look like I have a door anywhere. In case your grandfather needs to wake up at a certain time. <laughs> Ye old duck. Yeah, something like that. Duck! 
Wait, a duck? Which duck? Don't think we can get up there. It's really a weird world in which they have barbed wire on the top of buildings. Wait, um... So just because I'm slightly lazy right now, I'm going to try what happens. My guess is I'll fall down and if I'm lucky I'll not die and land on the balcony. Yeah. Or rather, if I'm unlucky, because if I had been dead, then uh, I wouldn't have to heal myself. Maybe we can get somewhere from there. Smells like piss. What a dump. It's interesting that they have one of those watchtowers here. Oh, that looks like a path that we can go. can't get that far, can we? Will we be seen if we can get on this wall? I want to get up there. That seems like a good place to go. of this. If I had a timepiece, I'd know. I'm gonna guess... what, three? Yeah, about three more hours. Oh. That was close. <laughs> Let's see where we last saved. I hope I saved after I did the whole blood flies thing. Because otherwise that would be a bit of work. Needless busy work. Okay, yep. Yeah. So there seem to be still a few blood flies in there, but I guess... Uh, they're not that important. Oh my. Is that my breath I'm smelling? Maybe my teeth are due for their monthly cleaning. There's something, if there's a door back there or something, it doesn't really look like it. Usually if you can go inside somewhere there are balconies to get to, but I mean there is that balcony over there that I can't seem to get to. So maybe, let's see, is it? Oh, come on. Why can't I... Can't even get on the wall over there? Oh, I can. Is 
Is that on the wall? Or I can't see it really. I guess we'll just risk it. What's that smell? Is it the fountain? Yeah, the water gets nasty sometimes. It flows from the fountain to the conservatory basement. And there was work being done, so there's a crate missing. <gasps> Maybe some crawled in there. He's seeing me. So let's uh, see. What was it? You've been found guilty of standing in my way. You aren't going the anywhere. Boy? This can't be. Strike it no way. Ouch. I Damn it. See any way to reach her. Whoa. What are you waiting for? Come on. Who's that? Oh, and I didn't crouch. Okay, yeah, that didn't work. I thought I saw someone uh, yeah, no. That's not working. Um, okay. Let's try that again. Yeah, I didn't mean to fall. Sometimes I wish this was one of those games where it was just, uh, you know, be detected and be dead. <laughs> I don't really want to do all that fighting. I don't I want to do the stealthing. <laughs> but all right, we'll see how that works. We're back here. So how the heck do I get over there? Let's see. I think shopkeeper's associate might be more over there, but how do we get there? And I think this is just the entrance to the building, right? Oh my. Is that my breath I'm smelling? Maybe my teeth are due for their monthly cleaning. Hmm. Can't get up there. Is there an exit or anything here? No locked. It's locked all right. Let's go back up there and see if there was any exit I've missed. I don't think so. Oh, maybe I can get on the roof. Yeah, these are plants that have grown here. Come on. That didn't work. Hmm. I have no idea how to get over there. get out the top of this building apparently Hmm 
Okay, let's see if we can get back there. Maybe we need to get around the outside somehow. I've got to get back to Dunwall. I feel so bad. I haven't seen the kids in two years. Ugh. That wasn't quite where I wanted to be. Close my locker before coming out. Last time I left it open, someone left a hagfish in my jacket pocket. Seems a very popular prank. You're the umpteenth soldier we've heard say that. All right. It's peckish. Could use a muffin. Maybe there's a nice tin of hagfish in the cupboard. Hmm. Of course I gathered them at dawn. What else? They're no good otherwise. Like she's the only one who knows how to gather black mandrake root. Oh, I guess that's uh Yeah, that's one of those witches. Try it with a waxing gibbous. If that doesn't do it, then I've got no idea how to fix it. Hmm. I'll be her favorite when she sees what I can do with a bit of cat fur and a bone from a drowned man's leg. Leave Karnaka. Rapallo, when you receive my letter, I want you to pack a bag promptly. Leave within the hour of reading this and stop worrying about all that terrible business in Karnaka. Stay with me in Sagunto for a month or two and I'll feed you until you're fat. We'll have an excuse to shop once a week to get you nice things in larger sizes. You know I bought a dozen of those fancy rugs from the weaver's market. If you'll join me at my tiny manor, we'll put them to good use. Alright. Sadly, that's not really an interesting location to be either. Okay, that's where we came from. Thrice. That's the part I always mix up. Tap the whalebone thrice, not twice. Mm. It's gotta be something nice. Something no one else has thought of. The months of nets. Maybe Fresh something with is gums so much better than dry. the bladder of a cat. Hmm. I have no clue where I should be going really to get to that oh I'm ah! Whoop. oh you don't stand a chance anyway can I uh what's this stinging bolt? You should have stayed in your four. Oh. I think I made her run away. Huh, that was nice. I told her a thousand times. You have to learn the words and say them just right. Otherwise the spell won't work, no matter how many goose feathers you've gathered. All right. So how am I supposed to get to the shopkeeper's associate? And I wish I had a map. Oh, let's see where that leads us. Whoops. Um 
That was close. Oh, okay, so we're now up there where I thought we would need to go to go across. And I think we can't go far enough. Still. Oh, damn it. Let's see what happens if we materialize on that ledge. Yeah, okay, we we slide down. And there seems to be an invisible wall up there. Ah. You know, usually I should be able to pull that up. Okay, so when I was here, I could have just gone up here. I wonder if there are any... any rat tunnels that I've overlooked. These noises are really disconcerting. Hmm. Ding, 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 ding. You're off for today, so you'll go and find yourself a bus. Okay, thank you for being here. And, uh, enjoy. And uh, I guess you have some catching up to do to be able. Do those windows open under the slidey roof? Nope, they're locked from the inside. Sadly. Is this the streets outside the conservatory? Yes, it is. It's like the side alleys. Here is where the... Uh, where the... Um, Bloodfly guy lived. Oh, what's over there? Blood fly nests all around them. Horrible. Um. Oh, we're actually. Well, I guess. We can pick that up and refill. display case what's in there looks like a camera or something but uh, apparently nothing we can actually interact with too bad nothing interesting in this cabinet That's where we came from, yeah. So I really want to get over there to Shopkeeper's Associate. But it, there didn't seem to be an obvious way to get there without running through all the guards or something. 
Oh. This looks nice. This would be really dangerous. With the weight of a human on the front of this, it would just fold over. So I guess I could turn off the radar. The watchtower might be worth doing. Still not sure how I get over there, because even from that building on, I can't get in through that window. Did I close my locker before coming out? <sighs> Last time I left it open, someone left a hagfish in my jacket pocket. Right. No. Gently drop it. Oops, what was that? Nobody noticed anything apparently. So glad they don't look up. One useless sock. I need to pee. Hmm. So can I get... Yeah, I can get back there at least. But that's still... I can't... find out how to get into that building. Those are all locked doors. Hmm. So I might just have to give up and go to the conservatorium. If I can't find another way. Because it doesn't look like I can get anywhere back there. And that would really be the best place to be. Okay, I guess let's make another attempt. But I think that's too low down. But hey, let's... Come on. smell. Is it the fountain? Yeah, the water gets nasty sometimes. It flows from the fountain to the conservatory basement. There was work being done, so there's a grate missing. <sighs> Maybe some animal crawled in there and died. Disgusting. You'd think someone inside the conservatory would complain. The place is mostly shuttered, but somebody's still inside. There was a delivery from Jindosh Clockworks a few days back. Whatever they're doing, Wouldn't I'd be happier if the gate wasn't so close to that night. fountain. I don't think this will work. Shakers. I think I'm too low. Uh, <laughs> Maybe this works. Sure, he had to talk with the boss. <sighs> what a lick spittle. Oh, hi. So, what was that? Let's see. What was? Ah, damn it. Yeah. Hey, where do you think you're going? Uh, no you use running. It can't be. Well, I guess we can at least check if there's anything else. I'm back here. Let's go. Damn you. Don't kill your friend. I'll be wiping ah. off your blood later. Yes, you will. Cuz I always forget to heal, but I guess uh So I just can't find a way to get over there, really. It looks I really wish those people you know why do they kill their friends like that seems so stupid really <coughs> <coughs> 
Why can't I get up there either? Ah, oh, come on. Huh. Don't kill your friend, kill me instead. <laughs> yeah. Really go for a whiskey or something. Then at least I could restart the game, you know. Did I close my locker before coming out? Ugh. Last time I left it open, someone left a hagfish in my jacket pocket. Is that the spot that I would hack, or is it... What's Isn't that noise? Isn't it day yet? Gotta be soon. I can't stand my own stench. Okay, nobody seems to be looking. Security panel. Gotta keep my mind on my duties. Forget about that kiss. Oh. No, that wasn't what I wanted to do. Yes. Oh. What I wouldn't give for a bottle of pear soda. Can I undo the rewire? No, I can't, right? Ah, let's go back. We haven't done anything yet. I didn't want to rewire the front. Don't want to fry everyone there. This is kind of a weird location, I don't know. I somehow expected it. Can I stand there? Nope. Okay, that was stupid. Hey, you know what I haven't tried yet? Let's see how this looks. Okay, cool. <laughs> it's faster than letting them kill me. Hmm. a fan here why don't I turn it on all right ah that's so much nicer So, where do we really want to go? I hope we can get there on our way back or something. I don't know. This looks like a path that can be walked. Walking when okay, that sound confused me a little well. bit. They say something's amiss, then I just can't get comfortable. Hmm. And this doesn't have any stairs or anything where we can get higher up, so that's not useful either. I guess we could use the safe code here if we bought it. Which I think we have the money now. But where was that? It's 
also the thing. I'd have to remember where I came from. And where I go, where I came from, Cotton Eye Joe. Um, you know. It's interesting that nobody even checks on this. Tasted awful. That weren't no blue jawed hagfish. River crust is more likely. Oh, there is an open door over there. I don't remember. Oh, that's. That's after the Wall of Light, right? Where we came through. The first time when I ghost walked. Do tonight. Start. Hmm. There doesn't seem to be anyone down there. Which is promising. Oh, but there's someone up there. So I still need to be a little careful here. Do you go in a circle down there or do you just go back and forth? Let's see what the guy in the back there is doing. Apparently he's doing his exercises. Okay. Come on, come on. I'm sure you can do it. Don't have to stand around there. Uh, okay. Let's see. I think you're yeah, not far enough. He goes over there, and I guess then he turns. So that means we can probably go down there and sure, see what that is. Oop. What a lick spittle. Ah, there's the whale oil tank. I think we might have removed the power from the wall of light now, if that wasn't the watchtower's power. From the power of tower, too sweet to be sour. Funky like a monkey, oh yeah. Now I got my A's and Z's. Tell me what you think of me. Uh, okay, so we might have a slight problem getting back up there. I'm bored. Yeah, you won't be bored if I accidentally... stay here because yeah he okay. turns in our direction oh it's blocked it's not good the 
This might not be the best spot to be. Huh? Nope. Oh crap. Anyone here? Show yourself. What? No, uh, okay. And a road for you. You aren't going anywhere. Tear <laughs> you to pieces. This head of yours you is going to work in silver. Ha! End of the road for you. Ah! Ah! you. I've been fighting uh, for you since I put on the uniform. Ah! Let's go. She's wounded. Let's finish her. Ah! She's dead. Oh, okay. What was that? Did you hear that? What's going on? No, no, no. I didn't want to reload from last checkpoint, damn it. Don't even know what the last checkpoint was. Oh, actually... That's a surprisingly not bad checkpoint. All right. Um I wonder if that door I guess they're all locked. on these wires no I can't I have received your request and agree that dinner time cannot come quickly enough unfortunately we are still on duty I love that phrase if I hear anything more sincerely me all right so the question is yeah I think that wire is the right one. Heavy. Hard to get a good lung full. <laughs> so I could probably ghost in there because nobody sees me. <laughs> Seriously, game. Don't really have the nerve. Just sure, let me land on the whale oil tank and have it explode. Damn it. I need to pee. I love the visual effect they do for these trails. So how do I get back up? I guess I just have to get... Well, I guess getting up there would be okay. That I think we were able to do. All right. What am I? Like a stuck metal leg. That's what. No. Something stinks around Worst here. Nothing. It's not my job to clean up. Uh, <laughs> Right. 
That looks good. Now let's find a spot that looks reasonably safe. That down here maybe. Oh, there's someone here. Okay, but here. Oh. Ghost stumble happened. <laughs> yeah. It just happened. You were clearing up a coffee spill and missed it. Oh, sorry about the coffee spill. Um, you remember the the watchtower where I took out the um, whale oil tank? And um, so I took that out of the tank, uh, out of the receptacle, and put it down below it. And then when I went back there and wanted to, you know, go down off the roof of this watchtower, I landed right on the whale oil tank and blew myself up, basically, is what happened. Okay, so that doesn't look very good. Unless, can I ghost walk there? see. Nope. Um, that wasn't good. That was completely useless because this is the wrong door. That gets me out, not in. Okay. Good to know. All that dizziness and blurriness for nothing. Okay, let's see if there's anything more over here. Oh, I guess that's their dog kennels. Oh. Maybe we can do something up there. Isn't it laundry day yet? Gotta be soon. Can't stand my own stench. Oh, come on. Can't we get up there? All right. Now maybe. No openable windows, apparently. Oh, is this one of those uh, transitions where I can't actually sneak into the building? Oh no, actually. Never mind, forget what I said. I'm a genius. I might not know that I'm a genius most of the time, it might not behave like one, but I'm obviously a genius because obviously I planned that. Why is there... What is that? Is that a trap? I don't think it's a bone charm. Okay. Good thing I didn't take the door, I guess. Alright. Let's see, what can we do here? Where can we go? Locked from the inside. They're good. Oh. Um. Is that a blood fly nest? Looks suspiciously like there are some really weird things over there. Can you see that? Some like moving, pulsing tree limb like thing. Not sure I want to go in there like that. Locked from the inside, okay. Oh, here. Um. Yeah, what the heck is this? 
It's a burning paper bag filled with something. You should step on it. <laughs> exactly. That's how it looks, right? Like a smoking pile of poo. <laughs> um, yeah. Hello. Admiral Ak Akbar Gif. It's a trap. Locked from the inside. Locked from the inside. Okay, so this is interesting. So I wonder, this really doesn't look like something I want to get too close to. On the other hand... Push out into the harsh world. Ah, she doesn't have anything to tell us. But I wonder, like, is this an egg? Wait, um, just because this looks so weird. set this on fire? Is that the way? Is that a stealthy way to deal with this? <laughs> um, let's see. I don't have any fire arrows. I have a howling bolt. I have a stinging bolt. A stun mine. I have a spring razor. I have a grenade and a sticky grenade. Okay, I guess this really wakes up and reacts in a fashion. And I'm not sure what this is, if that's another tree and I don't actually want to. This is looking at me suspiciously. No matter where I am, it's looking at me. And I guess I'm looking at the business end of a pooping owl. Wicked ladies and hunters of slithering things in the hours before dawn. Former milkmaids and magistrates. Come before me and bow. For I am Delilah, your queen. All hail Delilah. The moon in the sky and the mist lying over the lake like a blanket. Amelia, dear. If Brianna hears you and her mood is off, you're going to lose an eye making fun like that. She's only having fun, Francesca. And Brianna's too busy with the communion to be bothered. She's got her mind on the sisters of the oracular order. Yes, because otherwise the Abbey will see us all blackened by fire. Now stop with this nonsense. <coughs> Maybe there's a nice tin of hagfish in the cupboard. Alright. Ooh, the shadows in this game are amazing. That you can see an enemy's shadow at this distance. That's nice. Or oh. lavender tincture. It's good in spells and all that. But she may want to rinse that foul mouth of hers with it, too. <sighs> It's gotta be something nice. 
something no one else has thought of. Oh, they are very Maybe something when she sees size. what I can do with a cat of her, a cat from a drowned man's leg. I'm kind of wondering, like we didn't really see how she did this. It seems like she she created an apparition of Delilah. <coughs> I'm your devoted servant. Yes, yes, yes. What does she mean she's Delilah's favorite? She can't know that. For all anyone knows, I'm the favorite. And why not? The conservatory. I wanted to visit this place with Wyman. These black... waving plants. I told her a thousand times. You have to learn the words and say them just right. Otherwise, the spell won't work. Fairfield's dead. No matter how many goose feathers you've gathered, it could be a storm coming in. Uh, okay, let's... Where was it? This one. Maybe some steeped borage and chamomile will do the trick. Warehouse C67, Karnaka. Here. Oh, that's not good. <sighs> All right, I think. I think I was a bit loud. Every time I turn around, there's Just another commotion. I relax. Hmm. I didn't imagine that always the way. You'd kind of expect that if they saw an open window, one of them would come out. <sighs> oh well, oh well. well. Never mind. The heck was that? Was that a signal that she saw me and I didn't? This whoosh sound. Huge Scottish National Museum vibes from this place. I suppose vibes. Um, I suppose because it's also an expansive multi-level Victorian structure with all the wrought iron and stuff. Yeah, yeah. I guess so. I, I've seen a couple of museums in London and those aren't that dissimilar either. So yeah, totally. I'm sure that's what it's, you know, and, and all the dinosaur fossi fossils and things. Um, that's probably what they modeled this after, like one of those big historical old museums. I'm just jealous. If I want to dance, then I can twirl around all I want. Just try and st <sighs> Thrice. That's the part I always mix up. Tap the whale bone thrice, not twice. Okay, and uh, I guess we'll waste another of these sticky grenades on you. Obviously something is wrong. We all need to be on our guard. I don't think... They heard it this time. Good. Whoops. Hmm. Okay, and there is a rune or bone charm nearby. Okay already marked this so uh, where were we this one is what I want again um, is there someone oh there are some people here that's not good how do I get my bone charm 
few people are here. I wonder if I can get all the all the copper spoons and peoples and uh, oraculum. Shopkeeper's associate, rune. Huh. I feel like I'm walking way too openly in here and I should be sneaking more, but I can't see that many opportunities for sneaking. Also, not sure if I can. Just equipped spring razor. No, I don't think I want a spring razor against stun mine, might work. You know what? Let's risk it. against the wall. So the question is... Can I make some noise here? That they will come over? But there's three of them, right? So uh, let's use one more. Oh, there's a chloroform bottle. Didn't this work? Come on. Somehow attracting. Oh, okay. Good. Oh. There are two out. Nice. What was that sound? Okay, those are dead bodies, okay. Which unconscious. Another unconscious witch, okay. Ok, 
Okay, so I guess someone already triggered this one, and that was you, and then the other one went to investigate. Okay, I guess that worked about as I in intended it. Or you triggered two, I'm not sure. Alright. But I guess we're making progress. This doesn't look good. Dead body with... Oh, sleep darts. Thank you. Always happy to have sweep sleep darts. Oh, and there's Adermeyer. Yes, please. Now we can see over to him, but I think oh, maybe we can get up there now. So wait, this window was open all the time? I could have gotten in here? Seriously? Oh well, I guess it was too far up as well. Uh, okay. But that's good. Crossbow bolts. He has a conservatory map as well. Okay. So let's see. Where did we... I think this was where the wall of light was, right? So that's the entrance. Curator Ashworth's office. It's up the left somewhere. Oh, what? Um, it's a little hard to tell where we... Which side is in and... and Two is the lobby. Okay, so this is where the witches were making their pranks, I guess, and where the big turtle is. And yeah, and that's the stairs. I guess. I don't know. Opportunity. I have a new assignment for one with your unique talents. I'd like you to retrieve the old Rosebury prototype on display at the Royal Conservatory. It's likely well protected, but I'll double the finder's fee. Bring it back to me at the shop, MV. Reverberation tubing... Health elixir. Actually, we only need to find more Adermeyer. You refuse to use dark vision in this game because you dislike see through walls mechanics, but you can see now how, how you were making stealth a lot harder for yourself by doing that. You could have gotten in via that window. Yes, that's the way you went in the first time. Okay, yeah, that. Sounds nice. But at least we made it over to this person now. Scrimshaw. Okay, that. The Scrimshaws. I'm a bit sad that the Scrimshaws don't give whalebone. Ah, 
Adermeyer. That's good. Anything in that drawer? No. Alright, I don't think there's really much in there. Now that we found the info. Oh, there's a chloroform bottle in case we want to knock someone out. Okay, we haven't gone here yet. I don't like that this seems to be... Are there blood flies here? Alright. Lots of traps here. Okay, there's another one. We're playing dice tonight. You in? Sure. Guess there's someone outside here. Oh, he ran into that trap, I guess. <coughs> it's kind of nice that we're not immediately dead. Uh, wait, this button is what I wanted to press. You nah, up for a beer later? Not this time. Get the cigars, <coughs> you bet. Ah, okay. Wouldn't miss that. So I guess maybe we could get in here somehow. Whoops. <coughs> I guess that would have been... Was that how you got in? Getting into that building downstairs and then getting up the stairs? Okay, but I guess we've done the side mission. I wish I used... I had more use for grenades, but... Uh, Apparently that counts as detection. Nothing in it. What was there? No. Alright, so I guess that was all there was in this place. Maybe a health elixir if I needed it. So... Let's get back here and continue. All oh right, we got a bone charm. I should. Oh, I didn't realize this was boiling this much. All right, let's see what we can. Uh, do here. Learn how Ashworth corrupts the oracles. Oh, we haven't. So Burn knows more and we haven't found it. You think you blinked up to the wooden ledge in the hill. You've played Corvo the first time and his blink can have a longer range than far reach. Yeah, that... Okay, that's possible, yeah. Yeah, I didn't really see a good way to get up there. Especially with all the guards around. I guess I could have taken out all the guards and then maybe stood, you know, like, uh, like right underneath the wooden ledge. Like at that tunnel entrance. That might have worked. So, Rosebury 
prototype but learn how she corrupts where is that oraculum I think that's it so is that optional yeah I'd only have two optionals okay so I guess that's probably one of these things so I guess the oraculum probably that's the prototype yeah so that's probably what he needs from me or what what I need to find out I mean you can you can upgrade um, this see-through wall skill if you want um, and then it will show you items through walls and stuff so there's a, a way to make it much more overpowered silver egg ooh The subtle distinction in this game between pick up and uh, carry. Oh, so many dead people here. Also, there's a trick move with far reach that I don't think you've realized yet. Yeah, I haven't. I guess I haven't. The question is... I mean, I can get on top of something. I can, like, bounce off the wall. Which, more often than not, is a bit annoying. Um, I don't think I know anything else. Like, I can pop up between behind someone can have a longer effective range than first it seems. Are you talking about, uh, you know, like just using it several times in a row? So basically while you're materializing, try to do the next one? Because I guess I'm not really... For, for one thing, I don't think I'm fast enough to actually pull that off. And for the other... Um, uh, when I... Um, yeah, I'm, I'm kind of trying to save my mana. So I guess I don't really do that often. What's that? It's nice though, with all the dead bodies here, you you kind of get stuff showing up on your radar. Oh, this doesn't look like a trap at all. Oh, okay, there's someone over there. Depending on angles, and if you're jumping, it can pull you past the target point. So overshooting on purpose can get you places that are out of range, but yeah, using it multiple times in a row can also get you further. I think I tried to overshoot, like when I tried to get over the roof from that building, but they had like an invisible wall or something to keep that from happening. Oh, 
there are two of you there. Can I get on that lamp? Yep. Okay, so you are sitting on the railing there. Oops, oh, okay. They're teleporting, that's not nice. And if you see me up here... Fur, touched by something from deep down in the mud where there's no light. The endless womb and the cold, dead grave. Um, both the same. But Brianna's effigy has let her reach into the mind, into the heart. Wouldn't you be afraid she'd influence her dreams? Like she's going to do to the Sisters of the Abbey? That's part of the thrill, sister. <coughs> okay. So she's influencing the dreams of the oracles. We know that now as well. I don't like that they're sitting on the lamps. If they teleport and land on a lamp right in front of me, I'm in trouble. Okay, she walks back and forth here. That's also not so nice. I don't like this. Oh, okay, she keeps going. I don't like that. <gasps> Jindosh was tiresome. How does this even work? Ah, uh, damn it. Okay, yeah, that. Never mind. That's actually cool. Plenty of ideas. Okay. Luckily, I saved right up on that lamp before I fell down. <sighs> All right. Okay. You've disappeared. Let's try to... Jindosh was tiresome. How does this even work? Oh. Embergris, where am I going to get that? Maybe the incantation will work with just a little muck from the street. Okay. So we need lenses somewhere. Oh, here probably. <sighs> What does she mean she is Delilah's favorite? She can't know that. For all anyone knows, I'm the favorite. And why not? <sighs> no, I can't believe it. I, I can't, can't wait, wait for the month of nets. That's what I picked is so much better than I'll not let them us. And if he does, I swear I will never, ever let her go again. I will not let her do that again. Dance, then I can twirl around all I want. Hey, those are not lenses. Are those bodies in there? Maybe the wind or something. Alright, so we need lenses somewhere. Hmm. I have no idea 
Did I already see that somewhere? Okay, I guess we'll go into our, her office or something. Oh, here. Just our specific object. Yeah, the shopkeeper's associate. We've done that. Burn suspicions. Perhaps this is connected through the oraculum, the occult device that Sokolov mentioned. Learning more about the oraculum could be useful. We're gonna Ashworth office is on the top floor, overlooking the main hall. That's where you'll find her. Uh, Ashworth may have records about what happened three years ago with Delilah Copperspoon. Burns outpost. Vice Overseer Burn has a hidden outpost near the docks. Oh, that one I missed. Do I have to get all the way out now? Okay, that's Ashworth's office, so that's not really necessarily the place I want to be immediately, is it? Hmm. So I guess we're going... What is this sound? Oh. Do you see that over there? That looks suspiciously like one of those dogs. Thrice. That's the part I always <gasps> mix up. And it sees me. Bone. Thrice. Not twice. <laughs> oh. Grand Inventor falls to Crown Killer. The Grand Palace released a brief statement today regarding the recent demise of our irresplaceable Kirin Jindosh, the famed Grand Inventor for the nation of Circonos. The statement indicated that all evidence gathered thus far points decidedly to the Crown Killer, who remains on the loose and is actively being sought by the Grand Circonan Guard at this time. The statement was uh, went on to say that the Empire has lost its most brilliant mind and that the now vacant position of Grand Inventor will not easily be filled. Jindosh is best known for inventing the astonishing clockwork soldiers as well as the silver graph machine. Alright, so uh, I guess they don't... Uh, now, I mean, the public doesn't distinguish between... Jindosh and uh, be between us and the real crown killer. How did Jindosh die? Inside that strange house of his. I don't know, Delilah. Forgive me. No, my dear. It's a loss. But I doubt he had anything more to give us. Sokolov was taken away as well. Who would want that ancient fool? Never mind. How goes the communion? I am hungry to whisper into the ears of the oracular sisters. My influence grows. Last night, I walked through a dream with one of them, and we drank from a fountain in the town where she was born. The vice overseer Burns' suspicions were right. Dash won't affect things. No. He continued to tinker with the lenses. Thicker, thinner, more opaque. It was tiresome to watch. I still have the old lenses and cast-off parts piled in my workshop, but Jindash finished some time ago. The rest is up to me, learning to use the machine. A tricky thing, touching the void through such a device. Blood and biscuits. I look forward to using it myself once you're ready. Will you visit soon? Perhaps. Dunwall Tower is mostly in hand. The High Overseer won't be a problem anymore. And there's the matter of my own project. I grow more excited with each brushstroke. When I come to Karnaka, we'll drink an ocean of good wine and stay tight as a boiled owl. I look forward to it. For now, I need your eyes on the Duke. At least until we have the sisters under control. There's no one else I trust. I'll reach out to you again on the morrow. 
Farewell. Goodbye, Delilah, my empress. Oh, the statue moves. A corpse? What in the world? Hmm. It seems rather rude to die here, whoever you were. I guess this is her workshop. Where are the lenses? Oh, the astounding clockwork soldiers. Okay, that was the one with the human-like faces. Yes. Oh, whalebone. Oh, they're really giving us a lot of whalebone here. And uh, apparently she doesn't like to use a whiteboard, so instead she writes on the tiles. Okay. These odd lenses might be linked to what Ashworth is working on. Ashworth notes, the original lenses Jindosh and I devised for the oraculum were horribly flawed. Rather than focusing the energies of the void, the faulty lenses scattered them. My head was filled with noise, and the spiritual channel linking me to Delilah's magic was, ne was nearly extinguished. I will not cease my efforts until our coven controls the sisters of the oracular order, but I know now that I proceeded grave risk. The old lenses could have been my ruin. They are stored in my workshop for now, but must be destroyed. If I can sabotage Ashworth's communion device, she'll be powerless. Yes, that sounds good. So I guess she doesn't expect anyone to put the lenses there. I meant nothing to my fine family. Beyond an advantageous marriage and years of childbearing. They promised me to a man three times my age who wheezed on about our wedding night. But a curious thing happened on the way to the altar, Delilah. From the first time I slipped out of the manor in the dead of night, there was no returning to my cage. Looking at the stars and drinking wine on a rooftop, I was free. <gasps> Instead of seeing the overseers for marriage, oh, damn it. I visited my father's banker and raced away from my old life. Okay. So that's how these dogs works, and I guess it's no longer. safe to play audio recordings. <laughs> That's a bit mean of the game. Okay, um, but it's, uh, where is the... What does the voice say when you activate these skills? It had eyes? <laughs> I don't know what he says, yeah. I, I don't know. It's the nearest one. Ah, oh. they really scared me with the with the light moving around here. This lamp moving. It looked like something moving to attack me or so. Nice. So more like roll the dice or something. Ok, 
Okay, that's a bone charm. Black bone charm notes. I've set out to craft a new bone charm, and I hope to have it blacken in keeping with those of greater power. It will complement the one I've carried since finding it within a mausoleum in Alba. Though it's rare to meet others touched by the void, summoners beware, beware, for as long as I carry that bone charm, their rats and vermin will turn against them, and the new charm, if it works, will shield me against assassins. I'm still working on my protective charm. I've taken the Tivian grey bone recipe and altered it, using much more burdock root. The instructions were vague, and the safeguards it offers are weak. Neither chamomil nor nasturtiums added to the mix give me the right effect, though they per perfume the air quite nicely. I feel well protected from unpleasant smells, but not much else. I finally got it. Hellebore, of course, fermented and reduced over a low flame. It's rare to achieve this effect, where the bone charm turns darkest black. As I wanted, I'm warded against the first bullet or bolt from an assassin's weapon. The initial shot that would fell me will instead change to blood flies in an instant. Okay, that's good to know. So if we had tried to stealth shoot her, that wouldn't have worked. I don't really see who is speaking here. Hmm. What was that sound? Or you have to go back and play the recordings after you catch all dogs. Yeah, the question is if I'm then still able to. Once called Copper Spoon, now called Man I bested the infamous royal protector and ousted his brat daughter to take her throne. Now come and let me bathe in the warm waters of your adoration. Who is speaking here? Who is this addressing me by a false name? Cast her out of the city into the wilds. Or better yet, put her on a ship bound for Pestithia. So can I do anything against these howling bolt? Lines enemies cause an enemy to flee and forget. I guess I can use a spring razor, maybe. Sticky grenade. Oh, I don't think I'd have to get really close to it, I guess. Well, let's try it. It's a good experiment. Ooh. 
That hurt. Okay, so that's what these things are. Good to know. And thanks for the grapes. Jesus. Sleep dart. Oh. Full on sleep darts. That's nice at least to know. Didn't even remember that I had any. Okay, so at least I know now these little things smoking on the ground are dogs. <laughs> Those are some really cool designs though for enemies. Okay, there's no way through here. Oh, so that down there is probably that trap that we came by is probably also a guard dog that we would have run into. Oh. Uh I'm not here. Okay, so that's what you are for. And if I want to go down there... You know what, let's give you our spring razor. Whoops. Ah. That didn't go well. What happened? Why don't I have abilities anymore? Oh, okay. <gasps> you don't see me? not coming here. If you had played the first game's DLC, you would have met those witch hound skulls before, and indeed these witches. Okay, yeah. Yeah, I know that the DLC says something about witches, so I guessed that it's at least, you know, I don't know if, if the people, but like, that witches exist here was kind of clear to me from that. Once called Copper Spoon, now cold. My name is Delilah. I bested the Imperial oh, nice. Protector and ousted his brat daughter to take her throne. Ooh. Now come and let me bathe in the warm waters of your adoration. Uh, 
I wonder what it's... What this thing with the body is all about. Okay, I guess what we're doing now is heading back out here. There was always some barrister to torment, or some dock crew to lure into an abandoned warehouse. Those were good times. <coughs> hmm. This might not be the best spot. I guess we have to get back on the lamps. The Roseboro prototype is over there. Okay. But I guess we'll first try to get back to the lamps. But you know what? Um, I think we'll do a little break before that and then finish. Um, so, see you in a little moment. Um, get up, you know, rest your eyes. Do whatever else makes sense. See you then.